Roger Williams was a Puritan minister, theologian, and author, and one of the founders of what is now the state of Rhode Island. He passed away in 1683 and was buried on his own property beside his beloved wife, Mary Bernard. In 1860, Providence residents decided to raise a monument in his honor, and therefore dug up the spot where they believed the remains to be. Nothing was left. Next to the burial spot was an old apple tree which had sent two of its roots into the graves of Mr. and Mrs. Williams. The larger root had pushed its way through the earth until it reached the precise spot occupied by the skull of Roger Williams. Upon excavation, the root was found to have taken the rough shape of a human body, following the shape of a spine, split at the hips, bent at the knees, and turned up at the feet. The Rhode Island Historical Society has carefully preserved the tree root since 1860, and it can still be seen today. As the root had eaten away the mortal remains of Roger and Mary year after year, those nutrients had gone into the fruit of the apple tree, which in turn were consumed by the good people of Rhode Island. So was it the tree or the apple lovers? You decide. Who ate Roger Williams? Share your story below or follow for more tales.